This is a test light of the DJI Inspire 1 alongside the unique Typhoon H. The point of this test of course is to see if they hover together which one is more stable. Uh, it will be your judgment which one would you say is more stable on this test. So we're ready? Up we go! Before this test we calibrated both the machines and it went well. The batteries are perfectly charge and uh, we hope that they are both supposedly working perfectly initially I noticed that the inspire one is changing altitudes going up bit by bit I don't know what was the reason for it but I tried to pull it down the controllers are both on the ground so nobody's touching it both of them I should say this time I have to push the Typhoon H to the right because I thought I suppose that uh, it was affecting the signal for the Inspire one so it's getting up but still as you can see here the Inspire one is going up so I put up also the Typhoon H so they can level on the frame we can see here uh, they're stable actually so let's make the video go faster two times the normal speed so we don't have to go through the whole thing as slowly as it is uh, they're both uh, basically stable except for the changes in the altitude of the inspire one several times I pulled it down through its lever of course and uh, as you can see there are there is a slight movement of the Typhoon H sideways but basically altitude is perfectly fine on the other side the Inspire one the position is practically very stable but the altitude is not I don't know what's the reason for this so we go on with the test as you can see, ever so slightly, even at two times the normal speed, the Inspire one is moving up, changing altitude. Typhoon H has moved a little bit, but not as much as the Inspire one. Okay, so they have changed a little bit in both the altitudes. And now, as you can see, the Inspire one move up of the frame. So I pulled it down. It looks actually drastically pulled down, but it's not. Remember that it's two times the normal speed of the video. You can see here the Typhoon H is up. So I pulled it down, but I messed it up. I triggered going up, so that was my mistake. It's not the mistake of the Typhoon. So slowly I pull it down again. There. and it's actually very difficult to make them level together as you can see the inspire one is going up again and I tried to pull it down again the test uh, runs around 10 minutes actually before something happened in a while, uh, something is gonna happen with the uh, Typhoon H and the Spire one still going up, as you can see. At this point, we go back to the normal speed of the video so you can appreciate what is going to happen. At this point, there is a warning on the controller of the Typhoon H saying that there is magnetic interference. I tried to get out of it but still the warning uh, the warning sign is coming back at this point as you can see the inspire one is actually very stable in both the position and the altitude hold while at this point the warnings of the typhoon H is bugging me 
and started to move sideways slightly though but it's still worrisome because you are flying two drones together there it went out of the frame actually going to the right so I tried to move the camera and yet and now nobody's touching actually the controller at this point it's moving and the warning is still there it's like the controller is vibrating on the ground so this is worrisome the Inspiro one however is working perfectly fine it's not getting up anymore so I don't know what's going on and I decided yeah to put the Typhoon H down and that's the end of the test as you can see the Inspiro one is still there not moving at all very very stable I don't know what's the reason of the magnetic interference we are out here on the field there should be perfect no winds at all but uh, what do you think guys which is more stable the Inspire one or the Typhoon H